Number one, we always answer the same way. It's the people. Of course, and today we're saying goodbye to one of the folks who was a centerpiece of our success, and he's my friend. Rich Jaffe does everything with flair. The Price Hill Community Center is located just a few feet away from one of Cincinnati's toughest teen trouble spots. Before Rich was known for his trademark hats, it was a mustache that young man sported when he filed his first reports for us in 1991. Police investigation will begin in full, and perhaps she'll have an answer. While Rich was new to most of you, the Anderson and UC grad had actually worked for us in the 1970s, but then carrying a camera. But when he moved to the other side of the lens, he never forgot how important the images he once captured are to telling the story. That may be the reason he never hesitated to take you places others might not go, such as charging toward the eye of a hurricane, leading the way into what was left after a tornado tore through a town, or putting it all on the line when he buckled up and rolled into a frigid lake twice to teach us how to escape a sinking car. The first thing you notice is it sinks fast. And as if that plunge wasn't chilling enough, 15 years later he felt it was time we learn how to escape a body of water that had frozen over. Rich covered it all. Rich has often been at the heart of a good news story. One in particular comes to mind where a little girl got a new heart just in time. Rich never forgot his young friend, and thanks to him, we watched her grow up. In recent years, Rich has spent a lot of time helping people with nowhere else to turn. He's earned a reputation as the guy landlords don't want to see coming. Mr. Holbrook. Who is there? Lanny Holbrook. Lanny, don't run. Come on. You pled guilty. What do you want all your residents to know? I have no comment. You're going to be able to stay in compliance and get it all done by the 13th? Absolutely. But his tenacious style can also pay off. Ever since your report, everything has fell right into place, and I appreciate that. And making this once again a safe place to live. In Covington, Rich Jaffe, Eyewitness 12 News. So you're looking at uh, one of the best reporters to ever walk the streets of Cincinnati, and now he's going to walk some sandy beaches and probably have <laughs> the second part of his life be as good as the first. Yeah, without the same head of hair that we might add. Yeah. <laughs> so, I, I wear more hats now, though. <laughs> you know, and we, we talk a lot about um, what all you've done on TV, but I just have to say on a personal level, and you're crying already, it's going to make me cry, but this is one of the most compassionate people you'll ever meet. We are a family here, and, uh, you know, we've lost parents. We've gone through illnesses, different things. You and I are in that joint Knock replacement club. No, I'm, I'm not kidding. And you have always been that shoulder, that strong presence, that comforting presence in the newsroom for all of us. Very true. And we've shared a lot of uh, talks about the retirement and the second part of life and <laughs> mm -hmm. yes, how happy that can be. And you absolutely love what you're going to do, don't absolutely. you? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And it, I will keep a hand in our business, which is a good thing. Um, not quite sure exactly how, but okay. I, I will remain connected and truly connected to all of you. But ultimately, you're headed to the beach. You're going to do some fishing and whatnot. I'm going to do some fishing and hunting and kick back and spend more time with my wife than I have been able to spend for the last 26 years here. Yes. <laughs> you know, I learned that you were born in Florida, and I've known you for yeah. all these years and yeah. didn't know that. I thought you were yeah. born here because you grew up here. No, nope. born in Gainesville, always had sand in my boots. Now That's I'm going to awesome. get some more. Except I won't wear the boots so much. I'll wear sandals. <laughs> what do you think you're going to miss the most about this place? Uh, you guys. Oh. Family. We really are a family here. Yeah. Good I mean, answer, Rich. I like that answer. That. <laughs> I do too. I like your story too. Thank yeah. you. That was fun. Much. It was fun put together. Well, we appreciate we it. We wish you all the best. Yes. And we love Thanks. you. All right. Mm. I'd like to have one of those. Thank yes. You. See you soon. Thanks for you joining will. us, and we'll see you later tonight.